One man is dead and another is in custody following what police are calling Des Moines third homicide of the year. Local 5's Nora J.S. Reichard breaks down what we know so far. Shortly before midnight on Saturday night, DMPD officers say they were dispatched to the 3200 block of 30th Street investigating reports of a person who'd been stabbed. Upon getting to the scene, officers found a 33-year-old male with a stab wound to the chest receiving CPR from community members. When the officers got there, they continued that until the medics were able to uh, assume that life-saving effort. They took him to the hospital, but he uh, later died of his injury. A few hours later, shortly after 3 a.m., DMPD says they located the suspect, 28-year-old Jason Gene Parker of Des Moines, on the 2700 block of Boston Avenue, where he was then taken into custody. He has been charged with first-degree murder. Officers say Parker was caught on surveillance video fleeing the crime scene. We had some witnesses in this case that gave us some very valuable information. We had some officers who were familiar with the suspects from uh, some prior contacts. So we were able to locate him pretty quickly and get him in custody. So with the suspect already in custody, you might expect that this case is pretty open and shut. But officers tell me there's still one crucial piece of this puzzle that they haven't been able to put together yet. One thing that's missing is any idea of motive, and that's not uncommon in cases, but uh, you have someone who apparently without any provocation stabbed another person and then ran from the scene, and everybody wants to know why. In Des Moines, this is Nora J.S. Reichardt for Local 5 News. We are Iowa. Parker is currently being held in the Polk County Jail. His bail has not been set.